All right, are you ready for Thursday Night Football? Well, Amazon is. It paid better than 11 billion bucks to sort of own Thursday Night Football, and today's game will prove it here. Uh, but there is one little wrinkle. A lot of people don't know what the whole streaming thing is about, so older viewers might have some difficulty getting it. Uh, you know, we, we just need some guidance on this with Jim Gray, the sportscaster extraordinaire, best-selling author, among others, talking to goats. Uh, that's the wrap, right? I, I don't think it's fair, Jim, that, that people my age are sort of saying, oh, you don't know how to stream. We do, but, but the game on. And obviously, Amazon, you can stream just fine with it. So what do you think? Well, I think it's a big change for the NFL, and the NFL has been willing to change. Go back to 1987, Neil, they put the games on cable TV, You're ESPN. Right. It was Sunday night football on ESPN back then. And everybody, the audience, eventually went with it. Uh, then they did it with the Fox Television Network back in 1994 uh, when they left uh, CBS and, and jumped over. So uh, they've, they've been willing to change and move with the times, and that's what they're doing here. And, and, the, and the people who are in the indigenous cities, in other words, Kansas City and Los Angeles, tonight in Los Angeles, the game's on, on Fox, Fox Local, KTTV, <laughs> Channel 11. So the people in those cities will get the game. You know, Not on Amazon Prime, but... No, uh, I hear, I hear, but, but on you know, local station as well. You got Al, Al Michaels, 77 years young. Uh, he's a familiar face. Uh, he's got this very nice three-year deal. Uh, so that's a recognizable face, and that's someone who's going to be sort of a comfort in the booth. How do you see all this going? It's going to look like football has every place else <laughs> for a long time. Kirk Herbstreet has been a great analyst on ESPN. He'll be a terrific analyst uh, doing the games now on Amazon and Amazon Prime. So. Uh, they got Freddie Gadelli. Freddie Gadelli is uh, 62 years old. He did uh, Sunday Night Football for a long time as their producer, so uh, he's assembled quite a crew. They're going to do a great job. It's going to look like the NFL. It's going to look like just like every place else. People will struggle to find it. You're right. uh, they've told advertisers, uh, Amazon, that uh, 12 and a half million people will tune in, uh, but the TV networks who are competing against them say there'll be 7 or 8 million. So the, so the audience will drop off, but eventually they'll find it. Yeah, and the fact of the matter is, uh, football remains hugely popular. 75 of the top 100 shows on television are football, professional football. So it has that draw, doesn't it? And the ratings were up huge this weekend. I mean, they were up across right. the board. So uh, this is something new, and people aren't used to it. Uh, you can still go to the bars and get it on DirecTV and still go to restaurants. So uh, everybody who wants to see this game, believe it. They're going to figure out how to find it, and they'll find it quickly. And before you know it, uh, uh, they'll be migrating to more of these services as time goes on. <laughs> I think you're right. And my, my teenage sons will nevertheless volunteer. No, Dad, no, no, you can press here, you press here, and now you're ready. Right? We'll see what happens, Jim. And you, can watch it, and you can watch it on this thing real quickly. Exactly. Real quickly on your device. You're you know? exactly right. So you know it's going to come Jim. right. Hi, everyone. I'm Brian Kilmeade. I want you to do me a favor. I want you to click to subscribe to the Fox News YouTube page. This is the only way that I know for sure that you're not going to miss any great commentary, any great news bites, any great interviews coming your way on Fox. You can get it all here on YouTube. So subscribe right now.